Well, we're sitting down with another new signing for 2021, and it's Paddy Casey. Paddy, do you want to just start by telling us a bit about your background in football and where you started to play football? Yeah, uh, well, I was kind of a late starter, so I started under nine in Oilgate. The club was only founded around that time, underage-wise. Uh, it was actually my mother was one of the people that got the underage up and running in Oilgate, so I started there, and then in under-15, unfortunately, the Oilgate team... Uh, and I stopped underage mm-hmm. from my age group, so I moved to Farns uh, under 15 and I had success there. Uh, luckily, I was on with county teams up along as well and played with the school, so uh, I was kind of lucky in a way that I had another way out after all gate stopped. Mm-hmm. Was that time with Oil Gate then? And you were with another club afterwards as well, weren't you? Yeah, Farns uh, under 15, yeah. yeah. You must have enjoyed your time there a lot, did you? Yeah, definitely. It's uh, when I couldn't wait Saturday mornings or whatever nights we were training it was always a joy to go train with friends even meeting new friends up in Farns because I only knew one person up there when I first joined so it was really good f- to make new friends Excellent um, Now we have actually interviewed you before um, as I was saying to you a moment ago um, you, you did try with Wexford a few times um, before you before you were accepted um, did that motivate you in your time with Oilgate and Farns? Yeah, definitely. Like uh, I was never really a first team player, with, whether it be a county team or like I, as you said, I trialed down here a few times. But it definitely kept me motivated to show people that I was good enough to be able. And thankfully, I got my chance then down here with James. Mm-hmm. And you said um, w- when you were accepted in the trial that it was a big celebration in your house. It was a big celebration when you got the call to the senior team this year. Yeah, definitely it was. It's uh, it's nice feeling and something that hasn't happened in my household so it's very good for everyone in the house yeah another thing that you said that actually really stuck with me um was that you really like training and um, sort of down the pitch from the senior squad here in ferry carrick now you'll be at the other end of the pitch isn't that sort of exciting for next year yeah definitely it's a change like from looking admiring what they're doing to now being involved with is definitely going to be something that i look forward to yeah, and and like I was saying with um, with Evan and Kieran in the previous interviews, you you came here as a fan actually before um, before you you were in the trials and all that, and now you actually be on the pitch as well. That must be exciting for you too. Yeah, definitely. I remember coming down here uh, nearly every Friday night, uh, watching. So it's going to be a real uh, joyous moment when finally I'm going to be on the pitch and people watching me.